Um, the background music lives down here. See, I've let it hover and it says view, hide the loop browser. Well, we actually want to see it, so I'll click on it. Uh, there are a whole lot of background music loops in this program. I suggest that we choose the loops in the section called jingles. And I'm going to suggest that we look at these categories here and just for today, as an example, we'll click on world and it tells us there are 18 choices and I'm going to look for a clip down here called Sanskrit. So if I click on it, it will play. So if I click on it again, it will stop. So just as an example, I'm going to grab that. So I've got the pointer on it, I've held the mouse down, and I'm just going to drag it in here, and it will load that clip quick as a flash. And I'm now going to go to the start. I'll so click here, and I'll click play. Answers to key human rights questions. Who are asylum seekers and refugees? So I'll click stop. Now I want to point out some clever features about this program. Notice how the background music is quiet enough for the main track, the voice track that I've just recorded to be heard easily. And that's because this program has a feature called ducking on it. So I'm just pointing now with the pointer to this blue tag. And that tells us that this track, the music track we've just dragged in, will duck under the main track. And any, a main track is any track, here's the one I've just recorded, which has a yellow tag on it. And that's a rather neat shortcut. So it's automatically adjusted. I think at this stage we should go up to File and Save our project, so I'll just do that. Now the next thing is I'm going to move the slider over here on the left so I can zoom out of the project and see all of it on the screen at once. And we can see that it goes for about a minute, I'll just click here, a minute 19. So what I'm going to do is to show you how you could just move this. So I'm going to stay in the male radio noisy track and I'm going to drag over all these clips and I'm just going to drag them this way a little bit so that I'll click the playhead here. Um, 10 seconds is too much. I think we'll go to about there and we can drag this pointer. You better see what I'm doing now. So I drag the pointer and it shows down here that we're about five seconds. So that means this podcast will play with five seconds of music and then it will have speech. I'm going to um, shorten it by clicking on this track here and we can shorten the music so the podcast is going to be about, let's just click on the play headline here, it's going to be about a minute and a half. Now then, can you see this purple marker over here? This is currently the end of our project and you can see we've got about a Oh, over 30 seconds of nothing. So we're going to drag this to the very end and now we'll have a nice neat podcast. And I think we should go to File once again and choose Save. We're also going to click back here. So, so far we've got a basic uh, voice track. We've got some background music. Let's add a photo. So I'm going to go over here to the dock. I'm going to get, click on Photo Booth and it will load with the program and it's about ready to take my photo so I'm just going to adjust the screen so that my eyes are about a third of the way down from the top and I'm going to um, in terms of effects I'll just show you some of those by clicking on the word effects here and there you go we could choose a whole lot of effects I'm going to click back on effects but just for today I'm going to choose normal and I'm going to click on the camera and it will count in so that I know on three I should smile. And there we are and here's my photo just here. And I'm going to drag that photo to the desktop. So I'll, I just wanted you to watch this little trick. I've moved the cursor. We're still in photo booth. We know that here. But I'm going to click here and you watch in the dark for GarageBand. And I'm just going to move it over to the left a bit. I'm now going to hold down the command key and press tab. And we're now back in photo booth. And here's my photo. And I'm just going to drag it onto the desktop. 
So there it is. I don't need Photo Booth anymore, so I'll go to Photo Booth and click Quit. Now then, I can drag that photo into GarageBand, into the top track. I'll just show you that. I'm, drag I'm dragging GarageBand window around now by grabbing it in the grey space at the top. Put it back in the right place. And this picture here I can take back to the start. I'm just going to go click, click on it to make sure that it's the right size. So you can see down the bottom here it's got the uh, chapter artwork. So I'll go click, click on that picture again. And it gives me this little editing window and I could make it bigger or smaller. But that's actually going to be pretty good. So I'll click set. And because I want something to appear every time it's broadcast straight away, I'll put my picture over here and episode artwork. And at the moment it's going to play the whole time. Go to file and save because we've done something pretty good.